serious questions to ask herself in Short and Street. People will think I'm on the rebound and they might laugh at you. Well, I don't care. Well, you should. Well, I don't. Because I love you. I don't, 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 so what you're really saying is, you don't want TK to look like an idiot when Craig allows you to come crawling back. It's not what I meant. TK deserves to know where he stands. So make up your mind, will you? People are watching. I know. Okay, what we know for sure, our mystery mother's parenchyma is devitalised. So, Doctor? Complete hepatic lobe resection. I didn't fully explore the source of the retrohepatic hematoma. There could be hyaluronic injury and disruption. Something you may have to deal with. Me? I thought you'd be leading. Once you're patient, you know the extent of the liver injury, you can make more informed decisions. I guess. By the by who leads, we'll both need to be at the top of our game to pull it through. Come on, Katie, it'll make you feel lots better. No luck. She does not want to know. I mean, I don't blame her, this total stranger waving this totally foreign thing at her. Mm, and she's probably missing her mum. I thought maybe some music. I've tried singing to her. Yeah, and I got kicked out of the choir, so... You know the op shop by the fruit and veg? This was in the window. Quick, get ready to end it up again. This time, Katie, please. going on in there? Not a lot. There's nothing waving back at you? I'm going to have to do a shop, cook us some pasta or something. Well, we could go to the IV for tea. Oh, no need to overdo it. What? Letting the world know we're a couple. Well, you blackmailed me into it. No, I didn't. Well, I pushed you a bit, maybe. Mm. Well, it's done now, and I only wanted to keep us quiet because I wouldn't mind if people thought better of me, but... No chance, so the shameless hussy does it again. <laughs> we're going to be going... All over Ferndale. Poor TK. Silly boy. Wow, silly boy is damn happy. <laughs> Me too. But um, I could be getting a bit hungry myself, so back to the fridge. Is there any life left in that celery? <laughs> <laughs> wow, let's save ourselves for tea then. It won't last. She's just exhausted from all that crying. Well, what are we going to do then? You start 15 minute obs and I will go speak with the registrar. Katie has to eat. Mm. We might have to insert a nasogastric tube. Oh, poor wee thing. Oh, feeling sorry for her isn't going to help her. We just need to back off, treat her like any other patient and do what's best for her medically. Leave her. She might see the again. Just let me know if anything changes. Sure. Cutting last suture now. Inserting retractors. I'll extend the excision line to expose the subcapsular portion of the liver. Yes? Go for it. Expecting a major bleed. Standing by. Mosquitoes. Suction. Major, all right. Chris? Clamp. I'll try and control it with a princess maneuver. Clamp the free edge of the lesser momentum. Tubes in position. Aspirate now. Good. We need to get her to radiology to make sure it's in the right place. Could you call them back, Okay. I'm sorry, Katie. You have to do this to make you feel well again. Yes. Once you've got some food in your tummy, you'll feel much better, I promise. Yeah, I promise. 
We need more packages, Hosing. Chris, anything else we can do? She's gone into the VF. Give her more blood. Clear. Going again. It's not worth it, Chris. One more try. We can't stop the bleeding. Damage to the liver is too severe. <laughs> yeah, probably. No, you're married for a minute too. Uh... Thank you all. We have to give it a go, but the odds were against us. Not the return to theatre you were hoping for. Well, that's the way it is. Can't win them all. Doesn't stop you trying. Remember the last time I escaped for a really decent break? You love your job too much. <laughs> yeah, probably. No, you're married for a minute too. Uh, no, more like 30 seconds. What am I doing? Talking about my tragic past, how to turn a guy off. No chance. I worry about you and your rose-tinted specs. I know you have your flaws. Mm -hmm. Impulsive, volatile, impatient. Childish, self-obsessed. It's horrible to you. Oh, we should say hi. Yeah, make it a quick wave. Prepare for pistols at dawn when Craig gets back. Well, he dumped her. He can hardly comply. They've all moved on. It's got to be better at work, doesn't it? Sarah and Craig in the same room. That's always been a drama. You throw a mess. Okay, I'm stopping now. Sorry, had a bad day. Lost a patient in theatre. You're back in theatre. That's great. The patient died. Sad. Uh, seems the baby's not in great shape. Oh, well, they'll be doing all they can. Just like you did for the mother. No one's going to be blaming you. No. But that poor little orphan baby is going to be front page news. And so are the doctors who couldn't save her mother. She's a little more settled now, but keep up 15 minute obs, okay? Sure. The RV. It's Davy, please. Uh, just a minute. Jay. Thank you. Hello. Hi. Hi. Knock off time. Are you coming over? I'm sorry, I need my bed. Hard day. Yeah. Little Katie's mother died. Oh, who's Katie? You haven't heard the news about the mother and the baby in the car crash? Oh, yeah. And the mother's died. Babe, that's awful. Do you know who they are? Oh, baby. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I bet you don't want to leave the poor wee thing. I can't afford to get too involved. She's not the first baby I've nursed. No, but still, I... I'd better get home. I'll be asleep by the time you do, I'm sorry. No, that, that's okay. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, and hey, um... Can you wake me up before you leave? I hate doing that. Please. Okay. Thank you. I hope you don't worry too much about little Katie. I'll be out like a light. Bye. Bye.